Right, Mixed Fish UK here, back with another video. Got some new fish yesterday. As you see, it's clown loaches in the bags. Uh, there's some corries in there. I've got nine corries. I've got some panda corries uh, and some lazy corries. I'm putting them in 600 so I can wait them for now. There's the clown loaches there. They're going in. Another bag of corries. So there's four clown latches and nine quarries going in there with a the discus. And I've got another box of fish. I've got some plecos in there, got some L114s, uh, like sort of cactus plex. They're going in the 120. I'm just going to put them in the 120 now, we're going to acclimate them in there so they can all sort of grow up themselves. There you go, you can see my bristle nose is still in there as well. Got that one, that's the giraffe cat I think I've got. I'll make a big mistake in a sec. What I do is I put the giraffe cat in the 120 to acclimate and then I put them in the 2000 put him in there thinking he's gonna be okay with the bite shot and uh, guess what happens the arowanas go for him and um, I'll get the bite shot out okay he's out I'll put him straight back in the 120 and then uh, but the giraffe cat's in the arowana's mouth I've got him out he's completely fine you'll see in a sec there's my two datanoids they're going in the 600 with my other datanoid my discus tank That's the bosher. So I'm, I'm trying to be clever here. I'm thinking, yeah, I'll put him in the 2000. it would be fine. But he's not fine. He gets, uh, gets chased within seconds of him putting him in. So uh, I'll get him all back out. Nothing got hurt, so all good. Bosch is in there for now, it's just in the bag. Oh, I think it's a pleco, yeah, it's a pleco. It's a golden nugget, that one. So I've got three golden nuggets in that tank now, which is nice. Hopefully, I've got either two males or, or, or two females and one male. Right, I think that's one of the other plex. Might have moved draft cat. Put him in there, that quite Right, you can see my plecos and there's a draft cat, he's in there. In the bags. There's another pleco, it's an L114. Kind of like a cactus plec, I'm pretty sure it is like a cactus plec, but different L number. They get sort of wider instead of scales on them. Dogs messing about as always. Right, here's some of the plants I've got. Anubius. What tank are these going in? Discus. It's free Anubius. Will they eat them? Anubius. No. No. Um, Amazon sword. What? Oh, they're nice. Two Amazon swords, and then I've got this one in I've never had one. Which ones are those going in? Going in sword, sorry. Are they all going in discus? Oh, no, yeah, in sure. the middle? Maybe, and then I've got... I've got Obviously it needs to go in the water. That's what I'm trying. Quite cool though, isn't it? Anubius. Yeah, I need to take him out of the box. And this, look. It's got an Ingmazine. Your favourite? There it is at the back. Cool. 
is a video where I'm putting the fish in nets so the water doesn't actually go in the tank. So no dirty water goes in my tank, so it's just literally just the fish. So I don't know which one this is. See, this is where I've made a mistake now, putting them in the 2000, thinking it's okay, but Eric Wallace, being monsters as he are, goes straight for this, here's the body shot he's going in. I'll take him out of in about 10 minutes. You know what? It might be worth just putting them in straight from the bag because he's yeah. got. Um... So this one's poisonous. Yeah. Ah. See, so it's like if you get stung by them, it's like a wasp thing. Yeah, this is the draft can. I'll get them out within about five minutes because uh, the fish go from. You'll see them in. The 120 in a minute, all, all fine on their own, so no one got hurt. There he goes. Right, I made a little den for the fish, thinking it was going to be okay, and I'm, I'm taking it out now. I'm getting the arrows to go to the other side of the tank so I can get to the rocks so they don't sort of jump out on me. There we go, take the rocks out, then leave them in there. Not until the fish are a bit bigger. Bagging, I think it's a Corys, I'm pretty sure now. So they've acclimated, taken them out of their bags, put them straight in the bucket with the water from the shop, and then I'm going to net them out of the bucket, put them straight into the tank. There's some of the discus that they're getting a lot bigger now. See, nice no, clam lunches. So yeah, there's four clams there, they're going straight in. There's a golden nugget. Right, this is the plants, you've got some Anubias there. So I'm planting it all around the sides and sort of keeping the middle separate like I normally do. So it gives it like a sort of a valley look. Amazing how much plants change the look of your tank. when you've got monster tanks you can't really have plants in them because they tear them to bits. Right, next bit. This is the 120. Fish are whack, mate, now. They'll be going in. No, sorry, this is my peacock bass I got today, actually. So the other fish were from yesterday. These are my peacock bass. These are Tamensis. So, first time I've ever kept peacock bass, but yeah, this is them. Got two of them today from a shop. It's a bicha. There's the giraffe cat, see, completely fine. Giraffe cat got a little bit beaten up, but he's okay. And this is the bicha eating uh, some silver bait silverfish earlier on today so you actually can see this they're fine they're, um, they've recovered quite well here's the bass i'm doing a little feeding video of the bass on top of this in a minute you'll see how hard they take remind me of my old jaguar sickly a bit like that there's the giraffe cat let's see he's a little bit beaten up baby fine Right, here's the, here's the bass, this is them taking some silverfish, you can watch them take. The smaller ones got it. So that was their first feed today. But absolute monsters they will be soon. Right, this is a feed of my big tank, my 2000 litre. This is some uh, white bait going there, watch the Arowanas get them and the Oscars. And the Asian be over soon. There's a the silver. 
Asia. Absolute monsters. See, the Oscar gets about 10 in his mouth. It's quite a cool video with them. the arowana sort of taking off the bottom. You don't really see that. So. Oscar. Trying to get another one in his mouth, and he's got a mouthful already. Typical Oscar. Thanks for watching, guys.